Right, you got to come and take a look at this. All that cash right there, well, that's $3 million in cash. That's a lot of money. And get this, deputies say they found it after a man tried to hide it in barrels full of raw pork shoulders. Channel 9's Ken Lemon talked with the Cleveland County Sheriff today. And Ken, they think that money was heading to Mexico. Yeah, they think this was part of a drug enterprise. Let me emphasize, no arrest in this case as of yet. The investigation is still ongoing. I was inside speaking with the sheriff and other officers hoping to get a look at that money. They didn't give that, but they did share these images. And I want you to take a look at this. This is a stack of $3 million laid out on the table, seized during a stop on Saturday. This was inside pork, uh, pork loins. This was uh, wrapped in some cellophane there. The officer says basically he saw a vehicle violating traffic laws, pulled it over after talking with the person at the wheel, he began to get suspicious. They checked and then they found this. And I talked with the sheriff about looking at this money. He told me the first thing he thought about was the loss it took to amass this amount of cash. Listen. How many lives did was sacrificed and or taken either by homicide or drug overdose in order to obtain that type of proceeds from narcotic sales? And again, they tell us that they can release very few details about the process of making that stop, about what happens next. This is starting now to get into a federal range, but one of the things they hope it'll do is they hope that at some point they'll be able to get some of that money back. At one point with that interdiction money that they were able to get in the, few, in the past, they were able to buy 21 cars. They're hoping to be able to get that money back to help them and to continue to fight against crime like this in the future, Allison. It's obvious by this case, it's happening all around us. Ken, thank you for that report out of Cleveland County.